This is house number one. We were looking at it, and then we noticed that it had like a, I don't know, some leakage that was raining that day in one of the rooms, and we're like, uh, that's probably going to be a lot of money to replace. And then I think that little part right there was the living room, and then there was another room on the other side that we don't know what it could be. And then on that side is like a little breakfast room slash dining room. And then that was a garage. And then there's the little small kitchen. Wasn't really my type of kitchen. I needed some more counter space and cabinets. Now this is like another room. She said we could make it into another bedroom, but I think it would be weird to have it as a bedroom. And then there's the front door, and then there's like a little closet. Then there's the little restroom that they had there. And there you see Angelica recording. And then there's the master bedroom. And the two closets, the little side closets that were like into two, and then the little restroom they had there. And then you like see just a little bit of there. I love my mommy's house. You're looking at the other one. And then that's another bedroom there. That's me right there? Yes, that's you. And that's like a small bedroom. I think that would probably be like a nursery, but it's like small for a bedroom for either like a teen or another person. And then this is the second house we went to go see. I didn't really like the tub because it was like, I don't know, it was like, and that's the master bedroom. The tub was like weird shaped, so it's like you had to like do a wide leap inside the tub. And that's the master bedroom. And then there's like the linen closet and then there's another bedroom right there. It's like very small bedroom. Emily's like, oh, this is my room because it had a little playpen in there. Yeah, that's my bedroom. You like that room? Mm -hmm. But it was small. Yeah. And then there's the other restroom for the guests. That, that tub was better than the other, the one in the master bedroom. And then I like it because it had the sky the skylight in the restroom and then you walk out and then there's another bedroom there very tiny yeah so tiny I can't put my stuff in there hey mom mm -mm. and then there's another bedroom over here on this side it's like thing. I don't know what's inside that thing with the that they're very small bedroom. And then there's a small little kitchen. They had like a broken drawer, but they say they weren't gonna fix it. And then there's the living room. I like that living room. I saw a couch. The living room was pretty pretty big. Pretty decent. And then that was the pokey stuff. Then it had the the um the yard, the side yard. What's that? Yeah, there was like little pico picos there. Then Emily was like testing it out over there. It was chilly that day. Third day of house hunting. Oh my god, I just hit you. We will get Emily. My hospital. And then this is another house that we went to go see. I like this house and everything the third house that we're seeing right now but the only thing that I didn't like in the master bedroom it's small and the shower is extra small like I like the little fireplace there that's like another living room and then right here is like the little dining room and then further down is the main living room right here they made the garage into a living room so that would have been the garage but they made it into a living room, and then that would have been the dining room. And the little small little kitchen right there. Over to the other side. And then there's a little coat closet there. 
and then we're gonna go to one of the bedrooms pretty small not so big nothing would probably probably like a twin bed would probably fit in there and then there's a, the restroom for the guests and then on the other side of the restroom there was another bedroom they were like pretty small not very big or the closet's pretty big or nothing they're like petite but the master bedroom was small and so was the shower you'll see the shower right now it's like be like man how would i fit in here and then the little linen closets it was not that big but it was muscle menos and then there's the other bedroom so it was like a four bedroom but it wasn't that big que digamos like oh wow pretty big no now that's the master bedroom it's like uh, no now that's the shower look how small it is and then there's the kitchen and then there's the laundry room in there I like the farm the farm doors or the barn doors or whatever how you call it and this is another house I like the living room pretty cozy and in this house I liked it but it was I would have had to change the colors to it because I don't really like the pink splash on the behind the wall then that white space would have been a window but they covered that up and then there's a little pantry there it's like pretty small i was like uh no i like that it had central ac and stuff like that this they barely like they put that to the house because that wasn't there so that was like a built-in and that's like the master bedroom with a restroom and a small closet and then through the other side they had the washroom and then you would have to go to the other side through the washroom to go to the other side of the house and that's the master bedroom restroom and that one came with the like one of those ac that were like on the wall and then that side is where the washroom's at, an extra space. I don't know, it was pretty, pretty weird. And then the girls' room would have had their lights outside the room. That would have been the girls' room. They already, oh, we like this room because we could sit down and read books and look out the window and stuff. I thought that was pretty cool. The closets were pretty big. The restroom was sort of funky. Look at that. I'm like, uh, pretty, pretty tripped out. You know, the toilet far away. And then there's another closet over here. Thought that was random. But I guess if you have a lot of stuff like us, we would have to probably use that as another room to store our stuff. This would have been my dad's room. But, nope. And then there's Emily running around the house. She's like, oh yes, I like this house because it was it's like spacious and stuff and she could go make it in circles so she can go from one side to another side and not get lost or maybe even get lost I just didn't like the floors being all different colors and stuff now this one no I didn't like it small living room 
the people that used to live there weren't very clean, que digamos, because the stove area was, mm -mm. Then there was one bedroom downstairs. I was like, no, I don't like it. The random door in one of the bedrooms, small closet. Well, not really, it was más o menos. And then the restroom, we didn't go in there because somebody that was there before us went, did their duties and didn't flush. So like, mm -mm. and then there was another room up here. It just, it wasn't like, I don't know, like if they probably had like water leakage or something like that. Cause the floor was like, I don't know, like flimsy on one side of the room. And then. Emily was like, oh, yes, I like it because it had upstairs and downstairs. I was like, no. Uh, two stories, not for us. And then this is the master bedroom, but no. Nah. I didn't like the house. It was too small, and then the area where it was at, the houses were too crowded together, and there was not that much space to park the cars. So I was like, uh, no. Now this house, I did like it to a certain extent. Like, um, it was okay. I just didn't like those pillars in the kitchen. Like, why would you put pillars in the kitchen and the dining room? Like, uh, no. And then the island was too close to the stove and stuff. And mm, no, the color is pretty and everything, but it's, I just didn't like it being too close to the stove like it wouldn't give you space and then the microwave on the bottom like uh who would who would have thought of that no not our cup of tea look at that doesn't even give you space and then the the laundry room doesn't even have doors like uh no then the restroom And then another bedroom here. That was alright. I like the mirrors, but... Hmm. Not so much because the kids would probably break them. This is a master bedroom, like not big enough to be a master bedroom that bed's a fool and then the closet door is broken we would have had to been the one replacing it because they wouldn't have replaced it then the restroom it was an all right color but i just didn't like the pillars and it would have cost money to take those down or whatever and then they had two closets so there would have been a closet there and then the other one that had a broken door with the mare. Which is like awkward. And then there's another bedroom over here on this side. So yeah. Then the, those closets were like always out of the railing so it was like hard to open to see how big they were but we didn't even bother opening it now this is the house i liked because this is the master bedroom now this one was a pretty restroom i like this house and then the bedroom was cool 
but it just had like these things on the ceiling that we would have probably had to replace and then the closet we would have had to redo it because it was messed up I think it was like a lot of restoring it and stuff like that and we just didn't want to do all that stuff and the closets were all messed up and like uh we didn't bother putting an offer on it either. Then the door was broken from one of the from one of the um the closets in the bedroom. It just wasn't how can I say like properly taken care of or anything like that. They remodeled the kitchen and the master bedroom, but that was about it. And I'm guessing that they, what they did was they remodeled, they took down the, um, what's it called, the garage and built the, because I think that would have been the kitchen. That small little space right there would have been the kitchen and that space right there was the garage. This would have been the garage. All that would have been the garage and that other side would have been the kitchen. But look at that kitchen, how beautiful. It was a pretty high island and stuff. And then that was like a random, I think, pantry or something. And then the laundry room. It was just awkwardly, like, positioned, I guess, the rooms. I mean, the... This would have been the girls' room. It would have been like awkward, like having a pantry and or a closet on one side and then the other side would have been another, like another little thing for the room. And then the backyard through that door. But yeah, it was just weird. Like this, I think this would have been the kitchen. And this other house was like, uh, it was too small. I didn't really like it. I'm very picky. I wanted to have like a big kitchen with a lot of space. The pantry was más o menos, but cabinets wise, no. Then they had the ring or something like that, like a camera. And then they were making their garage into a bedroom, but you would have to probably go with the city to get the permit because it wasn't on the contract of the house that they were making it. So they didn't finish making it. So they left it as is. So you would have had to go to the city and say, okay, I need a permit to make this into a bedroom. And then there's another one. This is the master bedroom. Walk-in closet. But yeah, it was like the rooms were pretty small. Mm, the restroom was all right. All right size, I guess. And then there's another room right there. It was pretty small. Not so big. And then this was like the restroom that was like a salmon color pink. And then there was another bedroom upstairs. Like this house was like very weird. Like downstairs was the master bedroom. You go upstairs and then like in the hallway to the rooms. And some of the rooms had like water damage. I think I don't know if it was from the AC or from raining or something. But. It had water damage on the carpet. Like it was wet. And then when you walk it felt like you were going to go through. So 
Angelica was like afraid to walk through the rooms because she said it felt like if it was going to fall. So I was like, well, don't go in there then. And then like right here was when it was like wet. So now we're going downstairs. This is the linen closet. Then you had like, I don't know, there was like leakage on the, on the little side, like a side, um, whatever you call it, where you put decorations and stuff. There was leakage and then you could see the leakage on the, on the ceiling. And then this would have been the sala. Very weird how they posted the things for the TV. And then that's the master bedroom downstairs. Very small. All my stuff would not fit. And it was very weird because they had the master bedroom downstairs with the restroom. But then the restroom would have been for guests and stuff like that. So it's really not a master bedroom. I think it's just a restroom in general for just for everybody, I guess. Because it wouldn't be your master bedroom. It, your master bedroom restroom. thought that was pretty cool the sinks Very small pantry. I was like, nope. I like the backyard because it was landscaped and everything like that. Very nice. But the house needed some work. Now this is another house that we went to and stuff like that. It was like, it looked very modern and everything. But the only thing I didn't like was the laundry room was in the sala. Like, why would you have the laundry room in the sala? No. And then the master bedroom didn't have no closet, didn't have nothing. It was just like, just a room with a fireplace and two closets on the side. Like, uh-uh. I need my, my closet to be a little bit spacious. And then I will, didn't want to step on the little step thing that they had. And the kitchen was small. The pantry was small. And then the cabinets didn't even have like another shelf. It just had one single shelf. And then that would have been the guest bathroom. The builder didn't like build it like a way that it would be like functional for anybody because you're gonna need a closet that's like leveled and stuff. Why are you gonna wanna step on top of the mantle to get into the closet? Unless there was water damage in that area that they had it up a little bit higher than that or something, I don't know. Because this, I would have thought that would have been the master room, the one that I said with the fireplace, but uh, the other one is a master bedroom, but it's very small. You would have probably just fit a full size bed in that room. Like this one was the master bedroom because it had a little small restroom. But it wasn't big enough like the other bedroom, so it was small. And in the backyard.
It was pretty cool that it had all one simple tile. It didn't have different type. And then it had a way to go outside to the back. And then this was the house that we were gonna get, but it had a lot of stuff that was wrong with it, all the le electricity. And then the bedrooms weren't, um, they were added. So that would have been another thing that you would have had to go to the city and say you're gonna have to put it with the with the city and then the windows weren't up to date it. They weren't big enough, so if there was like a fire you weren't able to get out through it. Like all this piece back here was added. It wasn't in the main house. This was built in later. And we would have had to go to the city and say that there was extra rooms built into the house. So that would have been another cost of money. And then that laundry room had a fan that was added. So I was like, what? And then that fish tank, we would have took it down or something because it wouldn't have looked right. Even though this kitchen was small, we liked it because it had six bedrooms. And the kitchen was very, very small to the, the one that we had before. We had more space, more cabinet space. These cabinets and the, where the stove was at, it would like fall. Like when you would put your stuff on there, it would fall forward. So we would basically have to like build it, like drill it in. And then that's like the sala and then that other spot over there to the other side was another little living area. Then this is the guest bedroom, I mean the guest bathroom. And then that's the restroom. We would have had to clean it good because it had like mold on the, and then this room they didn't have no carpet, they took it out. So we would have had to put something there. And then the other, this one was the, another bedroom. This is the only one that had like tile, wood tile. And then this is the master bedroom. Like, mm, it was just weird. We would have had to take, ripped out the carpet cause the carpet was dirty. And the closet didn't even make sense. Like, why would they put the hanging your clothes very high up? Not that very tall. So I would have had to get like a ladder to put clothes up there. And this house, it was sort of freaky the way it was. It was pretty cool because it had like cabinet space and everything like that. But other than that, it just had like a weird smell to it. I like it because it was white. It had white um, backsplash in the dining room, but I didn't like it because it has sliding doors. I got tired of sliding doors. And then there was too many steps there. Different tile I didn't like also. The tile was like the one that threw me off and the way that the house was like different tile everywhere in the house. I don't know what people are thinking, like having different type of tiles in every room. That was pretty cool. You could see everything through there. But the sliding doors, no. Now we're going through this side. Now we're gonna go through the other side. And then there's one bedroom on this side right here. So there's one here, two windows. The floor was messed up. We would have had to replace all that, but imagine how much that would have been. Been like, mm mm, honey boo boo. And then this room was, is a garage, but they made it into a bedroom with the restroom. And the appliance, the appliances weren't there. 
So we would have had to, but I already had the washer and dryer. So that would have been the washer and dryer plus slash bedroom. Uh, it would have been weird. Having it as a bedroom and the washroom. And then the small little restroom in between. Two sides of the room or the garage. So that would have been two bedrooms. Well, actually three because it would have been one side the master bedroom and then the other side could have been Emily's room or something. And then that's the third. Well, the fourth room... Well, we could have said it's the third room. I just didn't like, I don't know. And then it had like a smell to it. Like the kids were saying that it was like a urine smell, but I didn't smell urine. I smelled just like it was like old, like musty. And then the restroom there. There was no electricity. And then there was another bedroom here. So this is like the fourth bedroom. And then this would have been the master bedroom. Because it had another restroom. See, look at all the different type of tiles in the house. Like, that just threw me off. I just didn't like it. Like, no. And then this is another house that we went to go see. This one was alright. It was pretty because it had barely been remodeled. But I just didn't like the stove right there where it would just pop out like the other house that we had, like the one that we were renting. It's like something like that that it was. I like that I had the sink in front of the window. You can see outside. And then this is another room with the washroom in the bedroom. And then the other room's on the other side. So that would have been like a little pantry. Oh no, it's a closet room. And then there's the restroom. It was pretty. I like that they remodeled it and everything, but it just didn't make sense having like the laundry room with the bedroom or a I don't know, like a playroom or whatever. And then there was another bedroom. So it would have been like, what? Three bedrooms? I think it was like four. In this house. So I think this is the second bedroom. And then the little... They forgot to put the shelves for the linen closet in there. And then this is another bedroom. Very small. And then the other bedroom right here. And then this is the other bedroom that was on the other side of the, the house. I don't know, it was very weird. And then there was like the restroom on the side. Like the lights, weird, it's not even on top. And then this is another house that we went to go see. There's the restroom on this far end of the house. Very small. Then you go into this side. saw a roach on the top we're like uh-uh honey boo boo and then we're going to the other side there's the linen the closet for the jacket then this is one bedroom very small like it's not even big probably like for a like a little nursery, like a crib or something. Toddler's bed. And then this is another bedroom. They cut it into two. So 
they took one of the walls off and made it into one bedroom, but it would have been like two in one. So that would have been three bedrooms right there. And then the fourth bedroom, that's the restroom. And then this one would have been another, well, it's another room. I think this one would have been the master bedroom. Because it was like pretty big. Because it had the restroom in the. But it was weird because it just had the half bath. It didn't have the shower. So you would have to go to the guest restroom and take a shower there. Then you walk to the other side. There's no pantry in that house. And then this would have been like the sala. And then over here was the bigger room. Way bigger than the other three rooms over there. Small closet. I like it that it had like the wooden floors. And then a small, another small closet on one side. And then I just didn't like that it was low. The ceiling was low. So Alex or Andrea would have passed by. They would have hit themselves there. And then this is the backyard. And then this is another room, uh, house that we saw. But it was only like a three bedroom. So I like the kitchen. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. And then we had like a lot of counter space. Then the little dining room. And then I like the restroom, how it's open with the window. But in this house, they didn't do the windows. So we would have had to replace the windows because they were back in like the 50s, 60s. And they needed to be replaced. But they just left it. They just remodeled the inside of it. So when we were like looking at it, uh realtor was like no you're gonna have to fix the windows because yeah the windows are old and then this is one bedroom here and then a walk-in closet that bear looks creepy just in there by itself Emily's like oh snap look there's a bear and then the wall looks sort of funky there. Like there was like a water leakage or something like on the ceiling. Did you see that spot by the window? And then there's another bedroom there. Some random light just in the thing on the side of the room. Then the closet. And it's like I had like a checklist on the stuff that I had. I wanted to have the laundry room in the house. I wanted to have a big kitchen with a lot of counter space. I wanted to have everything like a garage, muscle metals yard. But for me it was the kitchen and the laundry room had to be inside the house and the kitchen needed to be big. And the master bedroom had to be, muscle man was pretty big to fit all my stuff in. And then everything like a tile or, or wooden floors and stuff like that. Everything had to be one. But other than that, this is this house. I'm talking to the realtor. She's all telling me about the windows right there. And then this is a house that was like, I liked it because it had a huge yard. Look at that baby. It's huge. 
but the kitchen was pretty small. So it was a dining room. The cabinet, I mean the pantry with Muscle Man was pretty big size. And then I just didn't like that the island had no cabinet on there. Just look random open. And then the closet. One bedroom. And then going through each room here, it's like a four bedroom house. And then in the master bedroom, and it was pretty small. The closet was pretty big, walk-in closet. But other than that, like, it had everything that I somewhat wanted, cause, but it didn't have a big kitchen. It had all one floor, type tile, the yard was big, and the laundry room was inside the house. But my kitchen wasn't big enough. Yes, yes, I'm picky like that. And plus, it's going to be our house that we're gonna be living for a while so it's like I wanted to have everything that I wanted it took us a while to find it but we did and then this is another house that we went to see a few days later from all the other houses it was like again different tile in the middle Masa Menos counter space that I like. The only thing that was the problem here was the rooms were very, very small. Smaller than the ones that we've seen before. And like, this is like a taller room. You wouldn't fit, like you'd probably fit a twin bed in here because the rooms were small. And at first I thought this was the master bedroom, but that's the guest restroom for everybody. And I was like, okay, the rooms are very <laughs> tiny. Itsy bitsy room, look at that. Now this is the master bedroom, pretty small. I would have liked it to be a little bit bigger, but it was small. The closet was pretty big. Oh, excuse me, I yawned. This is the pantry to the kitchen. I don't really like wire cabinet I mean the wire pantry type thing and then that was a garage and then this is another house that we went to that was upstairs downstairs it just needed 
a painting and then we needed to fix the um I think it was a garage door that was like all messed up yeah I think it was a garage door that was messed up and then we needed to clean it paint it clean the carpet this was the mess the oh no this was this would have been the girls room it's very big They would have been my eyes because they were in the front upstairs. Then the restroom was sort of wonky and they would have to replace the sink and everything like that because it was just weird because it was like water damaged or something like that with the shower. I think the water was leaking and then there was another bedroom right here. Small bedroom. Muscle Menos closet. And then this was another bedroom on this side. Muscle Menos pretty big for the boys. And then you could look outside the window. And then the master bedroom was on this side. I like it because it had a big it was a big bedroom. I had a big closet, a walk-in closet. And the only thing that I didn't like that the restroom opening like the space was not big enough. Yeah, I would have had to replace all that. big closet and then we're gonna go downstairs gonna go look at the backyard there goes Andrea yep we're looking through there going downstairs I guess not and then this is another house that we went to go see now this house was like it tripped me out mainly because the bedroom that was this one was gonna be our bedroom the master bedroom right but let me tell you it didn't have vents so we would have been hot and we would have been cold so I don't know why they made this into a bedroom I think it was a garage before or something or they just added it on but they didn't have no vents I'm like dude you need to have vents in the room and then if you were to put something like the ACs on the window, como que no. But the rest of the house had central AC, but that room didn't have nothing. Like, where's the vent? And then this is the kitchen. Then this would have been the dine the sala. And then the remodeled. This was a remodeled house. Everything was remodeled. Everything was new. And then I just I don't know I just tripped out in that room that didn't have like a vent I was like okay this is another bedroom small bedroom I like it because it was black and white and gray and white my colors and then this is another bedroom on this side so basically I think this house was just a three bedroom but they added that other bedroom to the house because the other side is the master bedroom but it had a little restroom like little restroom you would have been like uh okay small room there's emily coming out the restroom and it's like you're gonna be like oh what where's your shower it's just the toilet and the sink it's like a half bath 
I mean a half restroom. Más bien. Small closet. Nothing would have fit in there. Now look at the restroom. Like, okay. You're just going to do your duties and to take a shower, you have to go to the guest restroom. Como que no. I like the kitchen, how it's like gray and black. 